I saw a pretty interesting post on Tumblr the other day, actually, how many great stories start that way? So check out this thing I saw on Tumblr. I saw an interesting post on Tumblr the other day about the actual ages of characters in films versus how they are portrayed. Often in a book, a character will be set at a certain age, and then when that book is turned into a film, they will change the age of the character, uh, if not in name, then in the actor playing them. And the example that they showed was uh, The Hunger Games. It showed pictures of Josh Hutcherson and... Hutchinson? Hutcherson. The post included images of Josh Hutcherson and Jennifer Lawrence when they were 15 and 16 years old, respectively. You know, the age that PETA and Katniss are in the actual Hunger Games, as opposed to them being like... 21 or 22 when those movies started. They look obviously drastically different. It got me thinking, why is it that we have to have things watered down in film? The Hunger Games is an incredibly popular book series and certainly millions of people have read that book and thought about 16 year old Katniss having to do all the terrible things that she has to do in the book. So why is it that we can't handle that in a movie. I'll tell you why. Because when we are reading a novel, we are able to imagine things in a way that is palatable for us, a way that we can handle. We know exactly how much we can take when we're reading a book, but when we're seeing a film, it's someone else's vision. And to have to actually look at 15 and 16 year old kids with chubby little teenage cheeks actually killing each other might be too much for people to deal with. We talked about this in the last episode of Sorted, actually, how Daenerys Stormborn in the Game of Thrones books is 13 years old, but some like pretty messed up stuff happens with and to that character. And reading it is one thing because you're not constantly visually reminded of how young she is. But if in the show she was doing like all the things that she does with Khal Drogo and she was 13, I think that that would take everybody out of the story enough that they couldn't concentrate on what was happening or, you know, forgive it because it's a medieval time period or a dystopian future in North America or something. Yet another reason why I love books, because books allow you to go exactly as far as you are willing to and no further. Whereas a film just sets something out in front of you and says, here it is deal with it. That said, I think there is a lot of merit in age-appropriate casting. Instead of having like 35-year-olds playing 16-year-olds actually get people who are 16 and 17 and maybe even 18, if that's the law, you know, you don't want to have them on set for too long, child labor laws. Thanks a lot, Industrial Revolution. Actors who are able to visually portray what is going on and maybe they won't be as good at acting as Jennifer Lawrence. And look, this is not an argument against Jennifer Lawrence. She should be in everything. And when the heart of a story is supposed to be about how uncomfortable it is for teenagers to be killing each other, it makes it more poignant when there are teenagers in the movie. I don't know, what do you think? Let me know in the comments. I hope that you're having a swell day. Until I see you next, be brilliant.